Hi there, folks. John Nolan here with your PM update for Wednesday's edition of The Times Leader. It has been a busy day in courts, politics, and more, so let's get started with that. A physician at Wilkes-Barre's General Hospital faces a $26 million medical malpractice verdict from a Luzerne County jury who found he mistreated a Newport Township man who had his right leg amputated above the knee. Ed Lewis has the details on that story. Ed has also been in the county court today where the double homicide trial of Jason Johnson got underway. Johnson is accused of gunning down two men and seriously injuring a third outside of a Wilkes-Barre nightclub in January 2021. U.S. Senator Bob Casey was in town Tuesday to announce $75,000 in community project funding for the United Way's grade-level reading initiatives and to meet with some area school children. Mark Guidish and Bill O'Boyle will tell you more about the senator's visit. Bill also has a look back at the life of attorney John Moses, who unfortunately passed away on Sunday. And in Lifestyles, Mary Therese Beeble met with some adorable parochial school students who dressed up as their favorite saints for All Saints Day. Remember, folks, if you're not already a subscriber, call 570-829-5000 or visit timesleader.com slash subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great night.